Welcome to the video where you can see books and copies all around, sometimes at my lowest, while other times me pushing myself to the very edge. And even then, failing to do so at the very moment, some emotions of regret, worthlessness, and whatnot. But never stopped believing in myself. Hello and a very good morning. So today is 23rd of April um, and I have decided to document my journey of uh, reading and giving final year um, MBBS exams so that I'll uh, be able to watch my journey one day and I don't know how many books are in this table. I have no space here and that's why i've kept some books there as well so yeah it's a whole mess a complete mess and here i am So hello everyone and this is 25th April so I have six days until uh, my final air exam officially starts so first we have medicine A and I kid you not I have been studying continuously from two hours but I am nowhere literally nowhere to my target so <sighs> again and this is another day but i'm not quite sure which day is today because yeah i'm basically on that page right now where i don't know the day date anything so four days are left for my exam okay this is my book and it looks like this i have written every possible information that i could from the books into these little um sticky notes and paste it in this book so that will be much easier for me to revise because i won't be uh, needing to open the book every time so that's how i study okay let's continue So, there's two days remaining for my exam and uh, I just hope that the questions are very, 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 very easy. Uh, I just hope that I will be able to see back into this video and uh, be thankful to God that uh, everything went well. Um, yeah, other than that, my preparation is still going on. Um, just wanted to give an update so yeah Anyways, um, I am all ready to go and pick up my admit card because we've got a notice um, that the distribution of admit card has begun and it's literally one day from my exam and the college has decided to call us today to take up the admit card. For that, I am now heading out and uh, I'll see you.
first exam and uh, I I literally don't know how it went uh, because the questions were very out of um, not out of syllabus but it was very you know it was all over the place that's what I would like to say about the question and uh, so yeah we still have three days until our next exam and that is the reason why I have not started studying yet um, just giving my body a little break that it wanted completed one subject and there's still two more remaining um, this is a laugh of nervousness actually so I am thinking of starting another subject and also completing another subject which I think is absolutely absurd uh, of me to you know have such thinking but we will do it anyhow I mean let's see so I am starting psychiatry now and uh, let's see how that goes I am very tired because I have been studying continuously from the time that I woke up that is 7 o'clock till now which is almost 6 20 p.m so yeah that's how life is going right now hello again and uh, tomorrow is my medicine exam just got back home and just look at my bed second paper done now on to the third paper I think I forgot to show you this so I had written this the day before yesterday um, these are the topics that I you know wanted to revise in the morning uh, of yesterday which was my exam day for medicine B and I kid you not, there was literally this question there, this question there, this question there, and this question there. <laughs> and what am I even? So yeah, I just wanted to show you this. not feeling well what I feared the most happened that is me getting sick during my exams and uh, having jiao lu because I am sick so I have been continuously studying and I honestly don't know where I am heading towards because the more that I study I feel like I will not be able to remember those information in my exams so that is stressing me out even more oh oops yes now tell me how am i supposed to study in a sound like this my head's hurting a lot and i have to study i can't even complain at this point of time because there's no point of complaining oh my god <laughs> somebody please just pick me up from here and take me to some place where I can study in peace. Um, I am this close to having a mental breakdown because of this. got back home and oh my god if i begin to talk about the question i mean it will take me a whole long day because it was like expectation versus reality when you study certain topics i mean the whole course of course but, but the question were completely out of thought 
But I guess that's what life is. I mean, if life gives you lemons, then you make a lemonade out of it. And I took that seriously today because I made up answers. I literally made up answers to I don't know how many questions. I just don't want to think of the outcome at this moment. So this is me sitting in my bed, which is all full of books. And now I will eat something uh, and then I will rest for a while. <sighs> So this is my mini calendar that I had drawn and I forgot to fill in the days that are already passed. So yesterday my was my um, exam and today is 29th which is Saturday. And I have not even counted the days but it feels like I have been sitting in this chair and in this desk surrounded by copies and books and pens and pencils and uh, I have had the same freaking routine since the past I don't know how many days but I think it will be worth all of this will be worth at the end I hope it does I pray that it does because I know I have worked very hard um, I know that I deserve to you know to to get the uh, outcome so for that i am uh, grinding in every day yeah i just wish that through this video everyone watching also have the same kind of motivation that i do or you know i am able to spread the kind of the motivation that you all wanted because uh, that is very important you know because at times you feel just devastated and you feel like you are going nowhere but trust me you are there hello everybody so tomorrow is uh, my fourth paper that is of surgery b and uh, as you can see i am already very tired and i just want to sleep and that's the only thing that i want to do right now hello everybody this is a brand new day and uh, we are successfully done with four papers now still two more to go so up next i have guinean ops and uh, for that we have a four days holiday which is i think never enough i mean holiday in exams they are never enough um because we you know cram at the very last moment and that's uh sure thing every time so today is uh, a very slow day up till now i have not studied anything a lot of talking let's do the reading now Bye. at this point of time i am so freaking tired i just can't tell you enough i mean i have been studying since the past how many hours I down to study from 6 a.m in the morning and it's um and it's how much 8 41 and i don't think i've taken breaks in between other than me going to the toilet me going to have my lunch or snacks so yeah and that's the reason why i am very 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 tired and still i have to go through a few topics and then i'll call it a day Bye. hello everybody and uh, so like that i am done with almost five papers and i have one last paper left so I just wanted to come here and talk my heart out because I was not quite feeling like myself. Uh, I don't know what happened to me. It's just a feeling that uh, is very, very, you know, um, disturbing. It's a feeling where I put myself in doubt. I was, you know, just questioning about my own confidence, about my 
um, preparation and will I be able to make it? Will I be able to um, do what I think I can? I mean, so yeah, these were the thoughts that was racing in my mind. And, uh, but I think that I can do it. I can do it. I just need to push myself a little more, a little more because it's almost because I've come so far and I cannot give up now, you know. Um, yeah, so I'll study. Day one. This was my second day of practical and I think that day was literally not my day because I could not quite reach my expectations which is okay. I guess everyone's allowed to have a bad day. Hello everybody, I know I have not been um, making videos of every single day because it is very stressful during exams and i am not very much i was not in very much of you know mood to film and um, but today i just decided to pick up my phone and film today is my uh, anesthesia practical and uh, which means from today my surgery week has started for practical tomorrow i have general surgery and for that i am just studying my exam starts from 8 30 and i tell you it's already been 32 days since my exam has started only my exam has started i'm not adding the days that i you know took to prepare for my board exam so it's it's very draining at this point of time my mind literally has stopped functioning i mean i am not able to tell the things that i actually know I don't know, maybe it's because of exhaustion by giving so many exams, but it's what it is. Hopefully it will end soon. Now I have still five more left. Yeah. Ooh, I just got back home and now I am studying for my tomorrow's exam which is surgery and i'm super sleepy but i could not sleep um, which is my usual story but uh, yeah i'm just studying and tomorrow i'll have a very big relief i have a three days um holiday starting from tomorrow and uh, then i have my dental exam at last and then that's the end of surgery practical so i'm just studying with the motivation that i'll get three days holiday so yeah let's Grind until tomorrow. Bye. practical and as we are the most unluckiest group amongst all we also have um oski for gyne at 7 45 sarp tomorrow morning which means i have to which means i'll have to study both pediatrics and gynecology which i don't think i'll be able to because there's a long list of topics remaining for me to complete from pediatrics itself and i don't know if i'll be able to touch gyne as well and on top of it to make uh, things even 
worse my back is hurting so bad that i am literally surviving on this so i'm just spraying this on my back and then i'm starting like that so it's a really uh, tough time and uh, yeah If there is one thing that I've learned from all this exam series is that you are not alone. There are people around you who are going through the same things, who are struggling in their own ways and uh, everyone has their own story and I just hope everyone deserves what they desire. So yes, I just wanted to cherish this moment because five years down the lane, it will all have been a beautiful memory. Hello everybody. So ah, it's finally happening. We are finally at the very end of our final year exam and uh, it feels surreal at this point. Um, I cannot even imagine how I got through all of this i mean from the day one to today it's already been more than a month that our exam had uh, begun so yes i still have one last exam and that's of gynecology and obs um, practical remaining which is the day after tomorrow and i just hope that this goes well too and then i will be done and dusted for good so yeah Right now I'm having last exam syndrome, <laughs> that is I don't want to study for it because maximum of my friends have already completed their exams and my group is the last one to have their exams over, so. Guys, our internship is better. Yes. Finish, finish. I'm not and just like that it's over five and a half years of mbbs has come to an end thank you all for tuning in till the very last i'll be back with another video very soon until then take care of yourself and the people around you and never stop believing in yourself Bye bye